up YouTube? It's your boy Bones the Trucker here in my truck. Figured I'd do a little video, uh, maybe a truck tour of what I got all going on in my 2010 Freightliner Cascadia. All right, all right, here in the cockpit area, captain's chair. I don't know if it's a captain's chair, but <laughs> definitely a good chair. I like the chair, it's very comfortable. Seat can be adjusted front and back, depending on how you want to slouch in the truck. A lot of different little doodads, you know, and adjustments. It does swivel. On the other side of it has these controls. You know, your different lumbar, your up, your down. This right here controls the shock, how much play you want to have in it, whether it's going up and down or not. Your lumbar support right here, twisty, dobby, dobby. Okay, of course I am rocking the split 10 Eaton Fuller. Most company trucks do have a split 10. It's like the standard, I guess. Crappy radio. Uh, it works when it kind of wants to. I can listen to the radio, but it does shut off and on by itself sometimes. The auxiliary port does not work, which really ticks me off. But the CD player works. But next time I get back home for a little home time, I got a stereo I'm going to put in here. That'll fix that issue. I can't listen to my own music off my phone, which I keep mounted right here. And right here is the mount for my GPS, my Ram and Nalik 720. All right, up here I got all sorts of storage. Here's where I keep my hats, and I got a couple earplugs up here that I got from someplace, I forgot where. Here, every driver needs beef jerky. Love my beef jerky. And I've just been throwing my beanies up here. What beanie I wanna wear? I've just been throwing them up here, I don't know why. You find a spot. Sunglasses, I normally keep them right here. But this truck doesn't have its little mount right here. But for all you don't know, you can mount one right here where the optional sunglasses. As you see this thing, there's a, a second one over here. But what you do, this right here pops out and the CB slides in. Okay, see there's no two screws right here. Okay, but there are two screws right here on top. You can see them. Undo those, takes it off. Some have the external speaker behind it. Now on the other side, if you don't have this little mount, you wanna know where you can put a CB. Right here, see these two screws? These two screws hold the mounting bracket for the CB that goes down where you screw in on the side of your CB. All right, and there's power and coaxial up there. So I was like, you need to buy an adapter kit, you know, that goes right here and da 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 da, or put it right here. I'm like, no, there's one right here, bro. And I got the Bearcat 880, it was on sale. I got it. I needed a radio. My other one, my uh, 29 Classic was kind of going out. The lights were stopping working and the SRWR meter didn't work. So it, the needle would get stuck. So I was like, oh, I'm just gonna keep it for a backup. I got this one, because it was on sale. What else do I got over here? Let's see, got my glasses up here. Uh, let's see. Safety glasses, safety glasses, both safety glasses. Even these are OSHA approved, thank you very much. Knickknacks, so just different electronics, wires, batteries, my camera, my, just a little cup. Air, I got a reflective vest. My wife left her perfume in here. She wanted me to spray my pillow with it so I'd smell her, I thought that was cute. My green Bible, gotta have that. My DJ crew. Got me this leg because I'm bones. I haven't found anywhere I want to put it yet. Still need to work on that. Uh, over here in this chair, woo! Reflective vest, hello, let's take you off. This one my beautiful wife got me. Thank you, baby. I went and bought the organizer for the chair just so all my stuff's in here. You know, I got my GPS I put right here when I'm closed down for the night, I guess you could say. It's out of the window. And uh, of course, Everybody needs a motor carrier atlas. I don't spring for the big expensive one. Why? Because I can still flip pages just fine. And two, my eyesight's not completely bad yet. Here's my log book. Thank God I run paper logs. Uh, this is where I put my sheets for my uh, inspection, but right now they're over here at my desk. I was doing some calculating. A couple of CDs. I keep paper clips right here. Big paper clips right here. Right here, I keep my two fingers when I'm doing videos, as you can see. Trusty jacket, hood and all that, nothing. Now we're back in the cab. Oh, sleeper of the truck. It is a double bunk. 
I am by myself. I don't like having the bunk down. I want this open room. I'm six foot four, three, five, which, depending on which convenience store I'm going out of. And I'm from, you guessed it, the best country in the nation, Texas. That's right. There's that. I got my 12 volt cooler. Oh, uh, yeah. Gotta have a trash can. Underneath there is where I keep my boots and my sodas and my hard hat, apparently. Boots, little Duck Dynasty softy shoes when you want to feel nice and comfy. My shower shoes. Get some freaking shower shoes or sandals. When you take a shower, you don't want to get athlete's foot in these places. These truckers piss and come, who knows what else in those things. So, yeah, wear these. All right, here I got my Empower Inverter. It's only 100 watt when it's hooked up to the 12 volt, 500 when it's run to the battery. I don't have it run to the battery yet. I don't have cable long enough to run to the battery, which is on the other side of the truck. But it works great for now. All I use it for is to power my audio back here. I have a little speaker, which I'll show you in a minute, and my laptop. Works just fine. Coaxial cable I'm not using. I was in the truck. Just pulled it up. We're good to go. And here's my entertainment system. A laptop. Great idea if you know you want to do multiple things. I mean, why get a TV and a DVD player when I got it right here? Okay. Yeah, there are my two beautiful boys. That's Eric and that's Jacob. They are beautiful and I love them very much and I miss them. Here's my power supply, or my audio. It's actually an old iPod dock that has the auxiliary input. It's not 521, by the way. It's just been five hours and 21 minutes since I plugged it in. The pantry! Da -da -da -da. Bowls. Gotta have my breakfast. I haven't been eating much since I've been on the road. I don't know why. Like today, the only thing I ate was, was dinner. That was two tuna fish sandwiches and some crackers and that French onion dip. No wonder they call me Bones, right? Over here on the other side. I don't use this handle. <laughs> but up here is where I keep my clothes. I have got to do some laundry. I was going to do that this weekend, but this pilot where I'm at, they know they're the only real truck stop well, like 100 miles away. So they charge your arm and a leg to do laundry, and I figure, well, I'll just wait. Because I know a lot of these mom and pop ones that have it, they're only a dollar to use it. So yeah. Down below, I got my trusty vape, which has a little leak in it, so I'm a little bummed. And of course, soda. Gotta have this, the best book in the world, the only book you ever need. I love this book. Extra reading, my guess. And this thing is not staying up. I gotta put this up, hold on a second. All right, I got the drawer, this is a long video. This is dirty, I can't clean it, it got like this. All my knickknacks and stuff's in here, I'm gonna burn some CDs later, as you can see, so I can listen to some of my own music. Knickknacks, blah, 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 more vaping fluid. Oh, gotta get that fixed. Right here, I got my water for my hot pot, some more chips, and some movies. Lots of movies, I love movies. Yeah, 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 all my controls, all my lights, sleeper mute, blah, 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 blah. AC. My pillows, three pillows, and my bed. Rawr. Yeah. Let's check out underneath the bed, shall we? I got all this stuff. I hate this area. I don't know if all the other trucks are like it, but the Freightliners had this huge area. Look at this, huge. I'm going to put my shoes right there. It pisses me off. I can't put nothing there. All right, let's open this up. Hold on a second. <laughs> Dirty clothes! Extra four inch straps, my laptop bag. Here I got this at a Walmart when I was walking out for recycled stuff. Empty plastic bags. Well, there's my trash bags right there. Alright, clothes hangers, I don't need them anymore. Extra two inch straps. This is kind of like my gear area, really. And I could put this over here. My Ram McNally 720 box. I just keep it in there for storage when I get out. Got an extra pigtail. It has some issues with it, but spare parts, and if I need to, it'll get me by and a fix. My light my wife got me. My trusty drill, which is my mother-in-law's. I got some edge protectors, here's my towel. I use my own towel when I go to the shower. Why? Because they're suck. 
water. Got to drink water. In fact, I'm going to get one out because I'm going to make me a green tea later. Yeah, just a little bag, blah, 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 blah. I do flatbed. So, yes, I have a rain suit. Extra bungee cords and battery. Shaving stuff. This right here is old Pringles can. I'm going to use it for some kind of storage or anything for nuts, bolts, screws, whatever. Moving blanket. Blah, blah, blah. I have two of those. One's cut up. All right, the other side I have my toolbox. It is packed full of tools. I have oil, extra oil. There's my brush I was using. Extra knickknacks, my tools. I got some sockets and wrenches down there. Okay, I have two fire extinguishers. One came from my other truck. I had a spare, so I got a spare. Spare lights, stuff like that. You never know when I have a light go out. Fast orange, clean my hands. I have a propane right here. Is it propane or butane? Yeah, propane. I had a brain fart for a second. And voila. So I can either heat my canned meals up or I can defrost some stuff off my trailer, like off my brakes and stuff. I don't want to melt my brakes either. Okay. W40 Flex Seal. I haven't used it yet, but I never know. Got my own glass cleaner and I have some electrical glass cleaner and I got some starter fluid. So yay, I have my strap roller for my winches, blah, 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 blah. Crowbar underneath there. That is my underside of my bed. That is my truck. Uh, maybe if you're lucky, I'll show you the outside. But until then, keep it safe, get home safe.